The first project of the Long Retreat Cloister was the central kitchen bathhouse building. It contains a large commercial grade kitchen and twin dining rooms and bath facilities for each wing. It was the most complex building architecturally and also the most expensive. In these early images, taken at groundbreaking, all that exists are stakes and ribbons. A year later, volunteer carpenter Seamus Holly gives a tour. So if you come here, this is the kitchen. And this is a, this is sort of an interesting room. But you can imagine if this goes away, then you'll have this sort of big, beautiful room that is the kitchen. And this will, this will be the main uh, central production area for Yeah, the 716, that's all 716. Yeah. The construction team is currently working to complete the north wing of the cloister by the end of 2007. Funds to complete this wing have already been raised. The south wing, which will substantially mirror the north wing, will follow in 2008. That stopped there, and then above that, that in this scheme was a trellis, and also this little piece. Uh, it would be a lot cheaper in the short run to do things differently, but we never were thinking in the short run. And so we're not looking to just benefit a few people going into retreat for a short time. We're also not looking to just for a short time sidetrack an enormous amount of energy from a group of people, uh, most of whom will never do a three-year retreat, but to present, um, I think, a situation that both Ken and Dan alluded to, where the unfolding of the thing itself, the building and all of the things that go on in the process of bringing the long retreat about is actually what it is about. Since the Long Retreat project began, KCC has raised $1.6 million from over 400 donors. During that time, scores of volunteers have donated thousands of hours of work. If you would like to learn more about the project or find out how to participate, please visit our website at kcc.org.